y'all done it? It's that time again. Better grab your balloons and invite your friends. Y'all know that sound. Better raise your fist. The search begins. I'm back, so enjoy the trip. Huh? With WWE Survivor Series approaching us live this Sunday on pay-per-view, welcome everyone live to Monday Night Raw, where tonight's main event is a big six-man tag team match, Undertaker, John Cena, and Nakamura against Punk, Kevin Owens, and Kane. Momentum heading towards Survivor Series is on the line. Also, we're going to have Bobby Lashley against Seth Rollins to kick off the show. Right off the bat, we're getting straight into the action. Here comes the almighty. The almighty Bobby Lashley returns to action here tonight. For the first time in two months since SummerSlam, Bobby Lashley's back on Raw. We saw Bobby Lashley about a week or two ago coming out pleading a case regarding a rematch for the World Heavyweight Championship. And then last week, on the last episode of Raw, you had Bobby Lashley again trying to plead his case, again trying to get a world title shot. But then Seth Rollins came out and interrupted Lashley. And then they both end up challenging each other to a matchup here tonight. So Bobby Lashley looking to get through Seth Rollins in order to get a world title match down the line. Bobby Lashley ready to go. And here comes his opponent. No doubt, ladies and gentlemen, a rematch from SummerSlam. A rematch from SummerSlam two years ago. Here comes the architect, Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins was the universal champion, even a leader of his own messiah-like faction. But then, so he just felt, he felt crashed and burned by the hands of the almighty Bobby Lashley. Bobby Lashley ended the reign of the universal title reign of Seth Rollins at SummerSlam. And then, Seth Rollins has yet to find his former self. Rollins has yet to get back into the world title picture. Maybe tonight, a win over Lashley can help Rollins get back into that title picture. Only time to tell as this match will kick off Raw here tonight. We're also going to hear from Johnny Gargano later on. We're going to have some women's action and then... Then the main event, we're gonna, also going to have Cruiserweight action as well. All live on Raw before Survivor Series. Seth Rollins, a multiple time champion. I think he's about a seven time world champion here in Universe Mode. A five time WWE champion, a two time Universal champion. Here we go. Bell is wrong and match begins. Got over will tie up into a waist lock here. Lashley now. Looking to try to put Seth away early. Lashley looking to make a statement not only from, not only against Seth Rollins, but the entire roster that he deserves to have an opportunity at the world title. And now, ooh, shot there by Lashley. And now, look at this. Oh, big dragon screw there by Seth. And oh, Lashley. That kick, and then, oh, able to block the kick, and then took him down with a shoulder tap. And now, Seth Rollins with a slip play, able to take him down. Look at Lashley getting back in it with a back draw. There's two dirty to the well. Go over to Seth Rollins. Ducks under. And it, oh, big shot to the midsection there. And now look at Lashley. Got him up here. Lashley. Oh! Gut buster. Devastating gut buster doing damage to the abdomen and then a gut wrench slam to boot. No doubt Lashley they're going to try to put Seth away here. Cover. The lateral press kick at it one. Lashley oh, himself looking to try to find his footing after losing the World Heavyweight title back in Summit Slam about a month or two ago. And Seth Rollins with a DDT. 
And now look at Rollins. Oh, wait a minute. Hook and leg. Look at this. Rollins. Guts. Let's get. And oh, wow. Watch the kick down before the one count. That's the same move that won Rollins the Universal title the first time at WrestleMania two years ago. And now. Oh. Big elbow up to the face. Trying to go for a kick, but lastly. Able to counter that. The visionary Seth Rollins is going to try to hold still. But oh, Lash with a clothesline. Lashley got bad intent. Oh no. Oh wait, Lashley over the top, onto the outside, onto Rollins. Bobby Lashley showing that he's looking to risk it all just to get a shot at the world title that he brought back in Universe Mode. Remember that, Lashley was the Universal Champion and then decided to bring back the big gold title. And then first chance he got to defend the title, he lost it to Kurt Angle. So no doubt Lashley is fearing about that and he's looking to do whatever it takes to get that championship back. I mean, even Lashley made a good point a couple weeks ago. Made a good point that when he was champion, things were in control. But then when Kane became world champion, things kind of went a bit awry, if you will. Things started to get a bit chaotic. And now Lashley are going to try to restore order. As the chief hurt officer of the hurt business. Driving the knee to the face of Rollins. Lash is just doing damage here. Cover. Lateral press. Able to kick out at one. Referee took a bit too much time to get into the cover. Oh, back over there by Lashley. Oh no, Lashley got him here. Front line. Look at the front line. The chances of Rollins getting a world title shot in the future. Hook in the leg. Does Lashley? No, Rollins kicked out of two. For a second, I thought Lashley had him. Had Seth Rollins right where he wanted him. Uh oh. Bobby Lashley. And no! Oh, Lashley with a spear! Like that, out of nowhere, Lashley wins! Bobby Lashley, ready to go. Lashley comes back with a vengeance. Able to shut down any chances that the visionary had of, of potentially surpassing Lashley of getting a title shot in the future. Lashley is back and he wants his World Heavyweight Championship. We'll see how things will play out at Survivor Series. And speaking of Survivor Series, ladies and gentlemen, coming up next on Raw, we're going to hear from Johnny Gargano, the Cruiserweight Champion, addressing Survivor Series live next. It's direct live on Monday Night Raw here in Fresno, California. And here comes the WWE Cruiserweight Champion. Johnny Gargano making his way out here. Johnny Gargano won that title from Ricochet at Raw's exclusive pay-per-view class of champions about nearly two months ago. Johnny Gargano able to win it in his home state, I believe, in Ohio. Maybe in his hometown in Cincinnati. But overall, Johnny Gargano able to win the title. Able to do things the Gargano way. Even if it means taking shortcuts and low blows and things of that nature. But tonight, Johnny Gargano going to do things his way regarding Survivor Series. So let's see what the champion has to say here tonight. No doubt, a lot of uh, attention is towards Survivor Series. Don't forget about the King of the Ring, which will also take place on Survivor Series in Anaheim, California. Gargano with the mic. Making things the Gargano way, he says.
Gargano's a bit shocked that he's not in the king of the ring. I don't know about being the superior champion, but in any event. Oh! Wait a minute! Right off the back, Gargano looking to challenge a SmackDown superstar for his Cruiserweight title. He's going to do things to Gargano, which is risking it all. But I don't know if it's wise. What? Wait a minute. What the? Hey, that's Kushida from SmackDown. Johnny Gargano made the challenge. And Kushida's the one that accepts it. Kushida at a SmackDown Live event. Able to make a... A brief uh, interruption to Johnny Gargano. Oh my God! Kushida and Gargano for that Cruiserweight title at Survivor Series this Sunday. Oh my God! I can't wait for that one, ladies and gentlemen. Gargano and Kushida for his championship this Sunday. Well, ladies and gentlemen, coming up next, some women's action. Il Shirai against Miss Money to Bank. Rio Ripley live next. As they're back live for more action here on Raw, here comes the former Raw Women's Champion in Io Shirai. Io Shirai making her way down the aisle. A big opportunity for EO as she's going one-on-one -on -one with Miss Money in the Bank, who could be a future women's champion. You don't know what championship she'll go for. Maybe the Raw Women's title, because Charlotte Flair, Charlotte Flair has been on the roll. But EO Shirai, they're going to go ahead and maybe derail the momentum that Rhea Ripley currently has. And here comes Miss Money in the Bank herself. The Nightmare! The Nightmare herself, Miss Money in the Bank, Rio Ripley. Making her way down the aisle. I mean, I want to know what's going through the mind of Rhea Ripley. After winning that Money in the Bank contract at the Money in the Bank pay-per-view a few months ago. I mean, for the last couple of months, in the last, maybe the last year even, Rhea Ripley's been chasing after that Raw Women's title. She's been in the ring with Io Shirai. She's been in the ring with Becky Lynch. But never won the Raw Women's title. Maybe Ripley has an opportunity this time to actually win that title. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Ripley and Io, one on one. That looks like Ooh, right off the bat. Big high kick there by Ripley. Kick to the midsection. And now Rhea Ripley got her here. Oh, Gord Buster planning. Able to plant down Io Shirai. And now Ripley looking to do some damage to that left arm of Io. And oh, big cutter. Ripley with a cutter onto Io. Goes for the cover. Able to kick out at one. Rhea Ripley knows what she's up against here tonight. Oh! Big side slam there. You're a Nike side slam by Ripley. And then, oh, drop kick. Io Shirai not able to get up the box yet. As Ripley with a Mitchell Luke driver. Ripley all over Io tonight. Hook and a leg, but able to kick out. And now Io would have kept up. And now Io Shirai looking to get back in it. Io Shirai, look at that. Got her on her shoulder. Just tossed her. Strength of EO cannot be overlooked. And double axe hand. I mean, these two were a part of WrestleMania this year. As uh, Ripley oh, able to land on their feet from the drop, uh, from the German suplex attempt, and then nailed EO with the drop kick. As Ripley now got her hands on EO. Uh oh. This smells trouble for Io Shirai. Look at this. Unorthodox style there by Ripley. Over the top. Hung her up to dry on the middle rope. 
And now Ripley got it here. Oh, snap, suplex. And now goes for the cover, hooking the lag, and able to kick out. I mean, it would be a big win for Ripley if she can defeat Eel Shirai, a former Raw Women's Champion tonight. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, Ripley. Riptide. Ripley with the Riptide. Is it enough to put Eel away here? No, kick out of two. Eel Shirai still in it. And now Ripley, uh-oh, once again, they're gonna go for it immediately. Riptide, once again, hook of the leg, shoulders it down, and Toner got up at two. I can't believe it. I think Rhea Ripley might have to work on a new uh, maneuver to put you away, clothesline, and another, uh-oh. Momentum beginning to shift. The clothesline and the kicks. Shot to the face. EO. Straight jacket. German silk locks. And now look at EO Shirai. Oh. That drop kick. Up top she goes. And now Shirai might. I say moves up. Got her down. Hook of the leg. EO Shirai. Big win. No. Not able to put Rhea Ripley away after that fury of offense there. Oh, no, no, no. Guillotine. Guillotine applied. After the fury of offense by Eo, not able to put Rhea Ripley away. Ripley trying to make Eo Shirai go to sleep there with the guillotine. That kick to the gut. And I got her up. Trying to go for a maneuver, but Eo countered. Got a record knee. Ripcord knee there by Rip by EO onto Ripley. And oh! Head scissors takedown. These two putting on a clinic here. Back and forth. And now oh, shoulder to the midsection. Up over. Sunset flip. Got it down. Is it enough? Sunset flip. No, kick at a two again. EO still in the match. Big headbutt there by Ripley. And now Ripley, a bit upset that Eel Shirai will not stay down. This is why Eel Shirai not only was able to become Raw Women's Champion, but Eel Shirai also a Money in the Bank winner in the past. Oh! Eel Shirai showing why she's been to the mountaintop before. They're gonna try to get back there. Oh, elbow right to the spine. Elbow right to the spine of Ripley. And now EO, once again up top. Ripley trying to get up, but again elbow to the spine. Very risky there, because Ripley started to stir. EO Shirai, trying to figure out a game plan here. And, ooh, shot there by Ripley. But still EO, able to withstand the shot and still got into the corner, big boot. And Ripley with a pump kick to the back of the neck. Pump kick to the back of the neck. That's most trouble for EO. Got the arm. They're gonna turn her inside out with the Riptide. Riptide by Ripley. Cover. Ripley with a win. Third time the charm for Rhea Ripley tonight. Three Riptides able to put away EO tonight on Raw. What a match. What a match you, <laughs> these two put on. Holy. Live this Sunday, it's WWE Survivor Series on November 7th. Featuring both Raw and SmackDown brands going at it in head-to-head -head competition champion versus champion matches. And two world titles will be on the line. The World Heavyweight title featuring Kane against The Undertaker. And also the Demon King Finn Balor will go one-on-one -on -one with the Tribal Chief Roman Reigns. For the WWE title and also the King of the Ring tournament. The whole thing will take place this Sunday on November 7th at Survivor Series in Anaheim, California. Don't miss out.
As we're back live on Monday Night Raw. And it seems that we're going to have the Intercontinental Champion in the house. As John Cena makes his way out here. The Intercontinental Champ won the title from Angle many months ago. Look at the house of words before his matchup later on tonight here on Raw. John Cena got a big week ahead of him. Not only tonight's big six-man tag team match, but also a Survivor Series. Cena will go one-on-one -on -one for the first time ever on a one-on-one -on -one environment in, on a pay-per-view against Christian. A match that people wanted to see for the last 15 to 20 years. And tonight, Cena and Christian will battle one-on-one. -on -one. But before that, it seems that John Cena is going to have a few words. Throwing shade in John Cena. Cena throwing shade at Christian. Yes, yeah, it's around the time Cena was rapping and Christian made a uh, diss tracks, if you will, against John Cena. No doubt these two are going to go one on one on Survivor Series. But it looks like Cena not only has Christian to worry about, but he wants to. Have a little confrontation with Kevin Owens. Calling out Kevin Owens to Cena and asking you shall receive. It seems that Kevin Owens making his way out here. Uh-oh. Oh, it looks like Kevin Owens is going to practice uh, social distancing there. Cena has a problem with the way out Kevin Owens went about challenging Cena. Cena wanted him to do it like a, a man. Well, oh my God. Cena. I don't know if you can say that on the PG show. Kevin Owens not. Uh, no, no lack of remorse there. No remorse in regarding attacking Cena. John Cena and Kevin Owens. They will meet eventually for the Intercontinental title. But before that, these two will collide. Later on tonight in our main event, but you can feel the tension in the air between these two. Cena did not like how Owens went about challenging him, and Owens does not care what Cena thinks. These two will collide sooner rather than later. My God, I can't wait. I can't wait. But ladies and gentlemen, later on, six-man tag, Owens, Punk, and Kane against Cena, Nakamura, and The Undertaker. But ladies and gentlemen, coming up next, Cruiserweight action! Here comes Akira Tozawa making his way down the aisle. We're going to represent the Cruiserweight division here tonight. Akira Tozawa, a former Cruiserweight champion in his own right. Akira Tozawa won the championship back, I believe, in a fatal four-way match at SummerSlam. About two, three years ago. And there comes a man that's looking to chase after that title. 
be chasing after that title since season five of Universe Mode. Here comes True Gulak. The man that claims that he's the best technical wrestler in the world today. He wants a better cruiserweight division. As the superstar is a part of the 205 Live brand, if you will. Drew Gulak looking to submit his way into getting a title shot down the line. Again, ladies and gentlemen, Monday Night Raw has the cruiserweight division on lock. They're going to showcase some cruiserweight action here tonight. And the bell is rung, and here we go. As a colorful, oh no, no colorful time. Front head lock there by Akira Tozawa. I think Gulak trying to go for a, a chop to the throat, but luckily Akira Tozawa able to dodge it. And now, oh, Gulak. Side rush and leg sweep. I mean, the last time Drew Gulak even had a shot at the Cruiserweight title, I believe, was all the way back at the Elimination Chamber pay per view in season six of Universe Mode. I might be wrong, but it was around 2K19 time. But Mustafa Ali was the Cruiserweight Champion. Jump a complete shot there by um, Akira Tozawa. And oh, a big Integuri head kick. And now Tozawa got him. Oh! A big bulldog there. And now Tozawa. Oh, the kick to the spine. And ooh, trying to go for a discus form. Couldn't get him. And now, oh, Gulak! Turned him over with a clubbing blow to the back of the neck. And now look at this. Just working on that arm. Gulak, a technical, sappy, like superstar. Knows exactly what he's doing ahead of time. Power bomb planet. And now Gulak trying to go for a wind-up clothesline, but luckily. Tozawa able to avert disaster. And oh! Tozawa. That centaur. Big kick there. And a wicked four. Now Tozawa got him in the corner. Oh. Able to turn it around. Try to go for a boot. No avail. Could not get him. And oh. Gonna stomp him in the chest there. Big kick as well. And now Gul oh wow! Gulak suffered a a big punch, a, a fake out shot, if you will. To Zao. Unorthodox superstar. Just gotta prepare of what's coming. Even though you don't know what's coming. Gulak got him air going special. It gory submission hold. Got him in a precarious hold here, but Akira Tozawa able to find a way out. Elbow right to the side of the skull and find a way out. Big chop, kick to the knee. Uh oh, here comes the Shining Wizard. Shining Wizard there by Tozawa goes for the cover. Very close to the ropes, but still made the count, but able to kick at the two of the Gulag. No doubt superstars like these two are striving to get an opportunity. Striving to get a shot at that Cruiserweight title. And no doubt about it after what they saw earlier tonight with Gargano throwing a challenge to a SmackDown superstar and not them. It kind of says a lot that maybe Gargano thinks he's above the Cruiserweight division. And look at Gulak here. They're going to apply that. Oh, the back of his neck. The unique maneuver, plotting him on the back of his neck, and still not enough to put him away. No doubt, superstars of the Cruiserweight division would love to showcase their talents, their skills, to where they will get an opportunity at the Cruiserweight title, hopefully, if Kushida is to win it at Survivor Series. Who knows? Maybe the Cruiserweight division might go over to SmackDown if Kushida wins it. Oh! Snap German! Hands underneath the ropes, the referee didn't see it, but able to kick at the two, did Gulak anyway. Gonna go for a chop, blocked it, and oh, kitchen sink, knee to the midsection. Down goes Tozawa, momentum beginning to shift here, kick at the two. 
No doubt things are starting to pick up here. Oh, wait a minute. Gulak. Gulak. The Gulak. The Gulak. Tozawa's foot nearly, nearly by the ropes. But Tozawa got a tap. Tozawa got a tap as Gulak. With the Gulak able to get the job done tonight. Wow. Started off a bit slow, but then picked up in the end. Gulak with the win, no doubt, has his sights on that Cruiserweight Championship. Make sure you click the subscribe button and the notification bell where you never miss a video from this channel. This Sunday is WWE Survivor Series where the WWE title will be on the line as Finn Balor, the Demon, the Demon King, the IWGP US Champion will meet Roman Reigns for the WWE title this Sunday at Survivor Series. Also, we're going to have a Raw vs. SmackDown Women's Champion battle as Charlotte Flair, the Raw Women's Champion, will battle Tony Storm, former adversary, a SmackDown Women's Champion, one-on-one -on -one at Survivor Series this Sunday. Like I mentioned earlier, John Cena will battle Christian. North American Champion versus Intercontinental Champion. First time ever these two will meet on pay-per-view in a one-on-one -on -one match. And just announced earlier today, earlier tonight rather, Gargano will meet Kushida for that Cruiserweight Championship. Raw versus SmackDown. If Kushida wins, potentially the Cruiserweight division could go over to the SmackDown brand. Will things still be the Gargano way? We'll find out this Sunday. And in our main event, the World Heavyweight title will be on the line as Kane will go one-on-one -on -one against The Undertaker for the World Heavyweight title. These two, these two brothers, these two men, they're gonna clash on Sunday. But also, don't forget about the King of the Ring tournament. Eight superstars, four from Raw, four from SmackDown. Who will survive? Who will stand tall? Who will be hailed as King of the Ring? And now, ladies and gentlemen, it's now official. John Cena will defend the Intercontinental title against Kevin Owens on the final Raw of the year. The Raw at Survivor Series, these two will clash for the Intercontinental title. But coming up next, ladies and gentlemen, it's our main event, six-man tag, Cena, Nakamura, Taker, against Owen, Punk, and Kane. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, a lot going on this week. Kevin Owens, we heard from him earlier tonight. No more so regarding what he did to Cena at Clash of Champions. He made it clear he wants that Intercontinental title. We're gonna get it by any means. Kevin Owens, a former four-time Intercontinental Champion. They're gonna make it five-time. When he has that opportunity on the next episode of Raw following Survivor Series, which will be the final Raw of 2021. In 2022, we will be kicking things off hot because then it will be going towards the Royal Rumble following Survivor Series and then we're going to be going into the road to WrestleMania. No doubt about it. There's got a lot of combustible elements in this entire matchup. Here comes CM Punk, the best in the world. CM Punk will be a part of the King of the Ring tournament. No doubt Punk has been searching that one thing that he needed in order to be in, the, in a position of main eventing a pay-per-view or main event status overall. Even being a part of Survivor Series just says a lot for Punk. I mean, this whole summer punk dominated as cruiserweight champion and now we're going to move on to bigger and better things kevin owen cm punk oh wow here comes the world heavyweight champion first time seeing kane in about two episodes ago when he attacked the undertaker after undertaker made a challenge that the Undertaker pretty much put it in set in stone. 
that at Survivor Series it will be Kane's resting place as World Heavyweight Champion. The Big Red Machine, they're gonna cause havoc on pay-per-view. That's Kane. They're gonna walk into Survivor Series and do what he does best. Cause carnage and dominate. Six-man tag team action in our main event before Survivor Series. Uh-oh. Here comes the King of Strong Style. Look at the cement that King part of the Strong Style nickname legitimately in the King of the Ring tournament as Makamura and CM Punk will meet in the first round of the King of the Ring tournament one on one. No doubt will love to call himself Kinsuke Nakamura. In the rising sun, they're gonna no doubt rise up from the ashes like a phoenix. And would love to go ahead and potentially win the King of the Ring. Remember, the winner of the King of the Ring will get a world title shot at the Royal Rumble pay-per-view. Relevation for Shinsuke Nakamura tonight. And uh-oh. Here comes Nakamura's tag team partner. The Intercontinental Champion, John Cena. The champ is here once again. We saw him early tonight with the whole thing with Kevin Owens. And we found out moments ago that Cena will defend that Intercontinental Championship against Kevin Owens on the final row of 2021. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. John Cena would love to have momentum on his side, would love to have the chip on his shoulder heading towards his match against Christian at Survivor Series. And there comes their tag team partner. A man, a being, a dead man, if you will. The conscience of WWE that is looking to do the one thing that nobody's been able to do in the last three months. Undertaker looking to do one thing. Be a one-man wrecking crew. A one-man destruction. One man of destruction against his brother Kane. Undertaker they're gonna do what others couldn't do, not even Randy Orton. We haven't seen Randy Orton since SummerSlam. And that was because of what happened in that last man standing match against Kane. We haven't seen Kurt Angle since Class of Champions inside the Hell in a Cell after Kane put Angle away. I'm gonna take a look looking to be the one being to put Kane down once and for good. And we all know how the Undertaker operates. It's not about just winning the World Heavyweight title. Undertaker takes something from someone with interest. He's gonna take the World Heavyweight title but also take King Saul. Ladies and gentlemen, Six Man Tag, live next. Live this Sunday, it's WWE Survivor Series on November 7th, featuring both Raw and SmackDown brands going at it in head-to-head -head competition, champion versus champion matches, and two world titles will be on the line. The World Heavyweight title featuring Kane against The Undertaker, and also the Demon King Finn Balor will go one-on-one -on -one with the Tribal Chief Roman Reigns for the WWE title. 
and also the King of the Ring tournament. The whole thing will take place this Sunday on November 7th at Survivor Series in Anaheim, California. Don't miss out. As we're back live on Monday Night Raw in our main event, six man tag team match. As Punk and Cena going out of here. It's been a back and forth affair between both teams in this six man tag during the break. And now Punk with a bow and arrow submission on the Intercontinental Champ. If Cena loses right here, uh, Cena able to counter, able to fight a way to get out of that hole. Oh wait, Cena! Cena! A! Double A! Add it to the Jester! On the Punk! He got him! No. Punk hit that a toe! I was just about to say if Cena wanted there. If he, rather, if he lost the match, momentum would not be on his side heading towards his match with Christian. That's Punk! Now that little history between Punk and The Undertaker. Cena Punk has a lot of history between Kevin Owens, Kane, The Undertaker, and John Cena. I think Punk trying to go for the GTS, but Undertaker able to counter. As the WWE's dead man able to take down Punk. And now, uh-oh. Uh Strapped her down. Undertaker, bad intentions. Looking to put Punk away. Look at Kane trying to distract the ref. Oh, the tombstone. Tombstone pile driver. Oh, the Punk. Punk's left foot underneath the bottom row. And now Undertaker. Oh, Punk able to kick his way out there. They can try to get out of that corner. Able to set him in the corner, double knees. CM Punk and The Undertaker have met before inside the ring. Who could I forget? At WrestleMania 29 in Newark, New Jersey, 2013. Bad placement there for the referee. That was when The Undertaker had his streak at WrestleMania. Punk was the 21st guy that The Undertaker beat consecutively before he met Brock Lesnar the year later. Tag. Here comes Kane. Uh-oh, oh, double locks him. And now, oh, wait, wait, wait. Undertaker, head on the throw. Undertaker, choke slam. Little payback for what happened two weeks ago when Undertaker got choke slammed by Kane. Cover, choke slam, hook it away. Got him, though, kick out of toe. Little preview before Survivor Series here between Kane and the Undertaker. And now look at this, Kane. Oh. Nice counter by Taker. Uh-oh. Tombstone. Tombstone on the Kane. I think Kane's left right foot underneath the bottom rope there. Yes. Kane's lengthy body able to pay dividends there. Look at the Dragon Super. Dragon Super applied. Oh my god. Oh, it's stuck to the side of the skull. A lot of big elements here in this matchup. And now, oh, nice turnaround, and now Kane. He to send Big Brother into the corner, and then followed up with a close one. And now Kane. Bad intentions. Oh, wait, and the ticket turned that around. And now Taker sends Kane to the corner. Trying to go for a right, but Kane turned that around. Back and forth here with the Irish slips. Tag, and now here comes Punk once again. And now Punk and Kane backdropped on the Undertaker. Oh, trying to go for a chop, and get him. Oh, big right there by Undertaker. Undertaker got Punk right where he wanted him. Choke slam! And now Undertaker wisely made the tag after putting Punk down. See, now they're gonna try to do something. We're looking at Punk. Had him scouted. And they were trying to go for a head kick, but Punk 
Help got blocked and Cena with that shoulder tackle. Back and forth here. And out Punk. It's Nightmare takedown. Kick to the spine that didn't face Cena at all. And Cena again with the shoulder tackle. John Cena. Measuring Punk here. Able to turn that around. Oh, look. Punk with the smart move. Made the tag with Kevin Owens. Here we go. These two wanted to get their hands on each other. Even get a chance right now. Cena with the sunset flip. These two have a lot of history. They've met before. Whether on pay-per-view or here on Raw. Cena now. STF applied. STF on Owens. Is Owens going to tap here? Oh, wait. Owens able to find a way out. Elbows right to the face of Cena. And Owens, oh, I, I think he might have heard something from Undertaker trying to distract him. And now Cena. That big right in the corner. Go to the, to the face, rather. And now look at Owens. Hook in the arm, but look at Cena with the elbow. And now with Cena sending Owens into the corner. Tag. Here comes Nakamura. Cena and Nakamura tend them off in. Pink back body drop. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Here comes Kane. Owens with the tag to Kane, but Kane trying to go for a drop kick. Owen. And he only did to go for the drop kick. But Nakamura had him scouted. Nakamura got him in position. Well look at Kane able to turn it around with a cross body. Kane turned that around with the cross body. And all on the big boot. Big boot on to Nakamura. So the best thing about six man tags is that you get to see superstars you never thought you want to see compete in the ring for a, a short time period before they make the tag. Never thought I would see Nakamura and Kane go out. The ship's got able to send him into the corner. That's Tunnel. And now it's Kane. Able to send him into the corner. And now Kane now able to make the tag. A little preview before Survivor Series and the King of the Ring matchup. Punk. Ooh, backbreaker. Backbreaker there by Punk. And now away. Oh, knee. And now look at this. Nakamura after, after driving the knee into Punk's mush. He's going to make the tag to Cena. Stopped there by Punk. And now Punk with a Bulldog. Punk able to follow up with a Bulldog. And now, uh-oh, got him up on the shoulder. Trying to go for the GTS perhaps. But Cena, elbow to the face. No doubt these two know each other well. And now Punk, Punk in trouble. Attitude adjustment. But wait, Cena able to roll through. Cena, hey! Is Punk down for the count? Nakamura in the ring to keep someone at bay, but Kane able to get in the ring in time. Nakamura with a backstab on the world champion. Oh my god. Cena with the back, the back attitude adjusters. But luckily, Kane was there to make the save. Kane with an uppercut, able to set Cena straight there. But look at Punk. Able to send Cena to the corner. And now, uh oh, there comes Cena's current adversary. And Kevin on next snap. And a kick to the spine. Look at Kevin Owens standing in between Cena and his tag team partners. Isolating Cena. Uh oh. Kevin Owens are going to send him up here. Stunner time. Yes. Owens with the stunner. Stunner on the Cena to put the champ away. Undertaker in the ring and able to make the save. Oh, Kevin Owens. He tried to go for the Undertaker, but Miss Wally and caught the referee there. Luckily, referee recognized it was an accident. 
Now they're going to end this match up with disqualification ahead of Survivor Series. They're going to give a little leeway if you will. Cena able to send him into the corner. Able to turn that around. Able to send Cena to the corner. Referee really needs to watch out here. Tag. Here comes Punk and Owens now. And oh, double shoulder tackle. A little shot to John Cena there. And CM Punk seems to be ready to go. As Punk once again with the bow and arrow on the Cena. CM Punk. Oh. Not able to make Cena tap, but Cena able to roll over. Able to get up the hole. Nice counter there by Punk. Able to send him into the corner. Trying to go for the Dominique, but Cena able to get up the way. And now Owens! Look at Kevin Owens here! As Kane with the tag, Cena! They're gonna do some damage. Cena and Owens going out of here. Owens with a big wreck to the face. Cena from behind. And now look at Cena, recognize that Kane is there. Cena's in a bad spot. He needs to get away from Kevin Owens and, and Kane. But look at Owens. They're gonna let the big red machine handle it there. Count of four. Kane able to send him back in the ring and out. Kane with a boot! Count of five. Kane able to send Cena back in the ring. And now look at Kane. Got him. But wait, Cena. Oh! A shot to the arm, kick to the midsection. Cena got him. Sunset flip, got him down, got him down. Pin the world champ. No, can't turn it over. Can't turn it over. And old Cena kicked out. Cena kicked out. Old Dux Kane out of turn of Jester. Cena the hook in the leg. Cena pins the world champion. Cena, momentum on his side, heading towards Survivor Series. Good night, everybody. From Raw and Fresno to the Survivor Series this coming weekend. Wow.